friends. So I thought it would be fun to do a little um, number work, a little number activity that I have with the rabbit theme. So I have all these rabbits and they have numbers on their bellies and I was wondering if you could identify the numbers. I'm gonna mix them up so they're not in order and let's see if you can identify the numbers by looking at them. So what number is on that rabbit's belly? That's right, that's number one. What about this one? Can you identify that number? What number's on that rabbit's belly? Good, number nine, super job. What about this one? This looks, mm, I'm gonna skip that one. What number? That rabbit has number five on his belly, good job. What about this one? What number is this? Good job, number three, very nice. Okay, and what didn't we do yet? How about this one? That's number six, good job. And this one, this one we just did. Good job, number eight, nice. This is a big one. This one has two digits instead of one digit, right? All the other ones had one digit, this has two. I see a one and a zero next to the one, that's number 10, ding, 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 ding. Did we miss any, did we do this one? Number four, good job, and then this one. What number? Seven, nice. Okay, so I have a little game that we can play. Okay, I'm gonna hold up a number like this one, right? In this hand, that's number one, exactly. And then I'm gonna hang up, hold up a carrot that has that many dots on it. Which carrot are you going to give to this rabbit? Which one matches? Can you look at the dots on the carrots? Which one do you wanna to give to this number one rabbit? That's right, he gets this one because how many dots are on that carrot? Okay, so that's the number one, and that's how one way we might show what one looks like, one dot, good job. Okay, let's mix it up a little bit. Let's go all the way over here. What number is this? Super, that's number five, good. So I'm gonna hold up two carrots. It's either gonna be this carrot, should I give him this carrot? Or should I give him this carrot? Which carrot does this, does this rabbit get? Well, did you count the dots on each carrot? Which one has five dots? This one does, good job. So I'm gonna give number five on his belly and then this carrot has five dots. That's one way we might show five. So I'm gonna give that. Okay, what about this one? What number is this? Good, number three. So let's see, which, which, hmm, which carrot am I gonna give him? Am I gonna to go to give this rabbit this carrot or am I gonna give this the rabbit this carrot? Which one, Did you take a look. Do some counting. Nope, not that one. Yes, this one. This carrot has three dots, right? This is number three, and this is one way we might show three by putting three dots there, okay? So let's see. Now, uh, how about this one? What number? Nice, okay. So this, I have this one. Should I give him this carrot? Or should I give this bunny this carrot? Yes, this is the first one because it has how many dots? Count them, one, two, three, four. Number four goes with the four dots on the carrot. Good job, I have uh, last one, this one. This, this is quick, you could see this is number two and very quickly we can, we don't even have to count these because we can also look at them and right away and see which one represents two. Yeah, good job, it's this one. Two dots represent the number two. So that's a fun game you can play, and you can play that at home. You can make your own. You can draw your own bunnies, you know, or you could draw your own chicks or whatever you want to do, and then you could think about what they eat. Like you could do a chicken and uh, or chicken and egg. Chick, I mean, chicks don't eat eggs, but chicks come out of eggs, right? Um, and you can practice showing the number and recognizing the number, and then how many dots go with that number, okay? Great job. Just a little bit of fun math for the day. Have a great one. Bye.